I think the greatest value that we've had from it is uh, to understand the pulse of the marketplace, to understand the key business challenges that um, operators and, um, and companies, uh, asset owners in this industry are facing at the moment. Um, so we can really come to grips with how we can help them with the services that we provide. Well, we essentially we assist businesses improve their performance. We use the techniques of the Toyota production system to improve uh, the quality, uh, the safety, and the productivity of uh, business processes. So, essentially, we coach and we mentor, we uh, help companies, we assist in problem solving, and we um, we seek to build capability and transfer knowledge of uh, lean manufacturing principles. Well, I think companies, uh, mining companies, need to really understand the value drivers, um, what their customers are demanding, um, and how they create value for their customers. Then they need to uh, really thoroughly understand their production process and um, understand where uh, they can add value to their customers. And that might be in shortening cycle times, it might be in improving yields, it might be in um, improving delivery times, etc. So it's really understanding what the key levers are to improve um, the, the performance um, that they deliver to their customers. Well, that's a, uh, that's a very big question, um, and uh, I'm sure there'll be a lot of financial analysts in the world um, contemplating that question. Uh, I think there will be consolidation, uh, there'll be some winners and some losers. Um, obviously the, the health of the Chinese economy uh, is, a, is a major uh, driver for the success of the mining industry in Australia. Um, and I, I think the companies that can, uh, I guess, exploit the um, volume opportunities that, that they have at the moment to, to shift product uh, quickly while this great window of opportunity exists and that manage costs well so that are accurate in their processes, that are accurate in their business systems um, and their frameworks. So um, I think it's about a culture of excellence and it's about uh, all of the sort of elements and teams and functions within the business understanding you know, how they contribute to that strategy and how they, how they contribute to that value um, that their customers are uh, demanding. Oh, yeah.